Our study is motivated by two important trends of the recent decades. The first is the emergence of global value chains, the fragmentation of production processes across countries, and the second is the emergence of the proliferation of free trade agreements. There's now hundreds of them. So what we are trying to do is to document the trade diverting effect that free trade agreements have on uh, trading intermediaries, and we do so by focusing on NAFTA, the biggest free trade agreement in the world, and what we do is create a unique data set that allows us to really not only measure what other people have measured before, which is the tariffs of NAFTA, but also the preferential rules of origin, which are a key feature of all uh, free trade areas. There are basically rules that uh, determine the origin of a good and therefore whether this good can benefit or can be eligible for preferential tariffs within free trade agreements. And we show that rules of origin, which have been uh, understudied, partly because of how difficult it is to measure, have a large and significant trade diverting effect. On average, in the absence of rules of origin, uh, imports of, from third countries into NAFTA would have been 45% larger. So it's not only an effect that is significant, but it's also very sizable, and it depends on whether the rules of origin are strict or flexible. The key negative effect, the distortionary effect, comes from rules that are uh, strict and relevant in the sense that producers of final goods have an incentive to comply with them.